so quickly before we start with the vlog i really wanted to share these two products with you guys because i realized i really didn't so i thought i'd just throw it in here while i'm editing but um i wholeheartedly believe in this company you guys you know i you have to know that or else i would not share this stuff with you they're called you natural i'm obsessed i've been using their flourish and their my brain vitamins um this one is obviously for gut health um and it also promotes urinary health which is also incredible um and then i've been also using their my brain which is promoting healthy brain function which is mostly targeted at like migraine and headache relief but it also is really soothing for my anxiety i've noticed i've been taking them officially this friday like two weeks um and i've noticed huge differences this one i take three times a day with a meal and water and if not a meal i usually just take a snack or do 16 ounces of water Flourish, I just take in the morning. Um, I take it with my smoothie and with my water. Uh, but yeah, they're 100% vegetarian and you guys can actually open these pills and just use the powder if you're not like a big swallowing pill person. They have no artificial additives. There's no strange chemical fillers. They have no wheat, gluten, dairy, nuts, or eggs. Um, obviously, or else I wouldn't be able to take them. They're hypoallergenic. They've never been tested on animals. And like I said, again, everything about the capsules is 100% vegetarian and easy to swallow. And you can also open them out of the pill form. Yeah, I think they're so incredible. They also have so many more options on their website, so I can leave that down below. But I swear, you guys, for me to be able to share something that can not only help with my anxiety, but also my migraines. You guys know I'm always like in some type of vlog complaining about headaches. And then again, with my gut health, you guys, this one is like a game changer on my gut. I'm, I've been looking for so long to start a um, probiotic, and I'm really glad that this company worked um, with me when they did because I was desperate to find something that would help on the back of the bottles too it kind of tells you like how it helps um they have like all of their ingredients and how you should take it a cool thing about this company is also that with every um, new natural vitamin purchase they donate one year supply of vitamins to women and children in need and i think that's really incredible but yeah i will share everything about them down below if you guys are interested in looking at them more they have a lot more options on their website, different types of things you could sign up for or look into. So yeah, I will have that link below, but let's get into the video. Hi guys, what is up? And welcome back to my channel. Today is Monday, March 29th. I am very excited for today because today it was the first day I really wanted to wake up and start some new healthy, positive habits that I really want to implement in my life. I do start um, my sixth quarter next Monday. So I thought, this week would be the perfect um, week to start implementing those things so I can go into next week, um, that first week of the quarter, just feeling a little bit more refreshed, feeling like maybe a little bit more balanced and maybe just, I don't know, feeling more prepared and willing to be and stay motivated for next quarter. Um, I definitely need to stay on top of everything, especially now that I have a job. But speaking of that job, today it is 12.56 and I'm about to start in four minutes. I have my first day of work technically um but thankfully it's from the comfort of my own home i have this virtual online orientation that i have to do um that must be completed in order for me to start in the hospital so i get to do these and then i have an in-person orientation like a hospital orientation on the 12th so i'm going to do this today she did say it will take around like four and a half to six hours so i definitely wanted to try and crunch that out um hopefully can spend like the next few hours today it does not have to be done today but i'd like to get it done today just to have it out of the way um so we're gonna be pretty much locked in the house all day but i do have a couple of packages coming in today that i'm really excited about also i want to show you guys this cute zip up it's a little hanes one um i really just needed something to zip up um over my workout stuff because i was so sick of taking my hat and my like headphones and stuff off going back and forth from the gym and this is just really easy to throw on but i will link it down below i got it from amazon and i got a large and it's men's and i really like it so yeah i have some packages coming in that i will show you guys a little bit later but just wanted to update you guys and say welcome to welcome to the vlog because we're gonna have a little productive day and i just do not know besides of what i've already showed you how much more i'll vlog um at least until the evening but yeah welcome to my channel and let's have a really healthy productive exciting week Okay, so it has been a few hours since I talked to you guys last. Don't worry, it's still Monday. It is 7.22, and I have been working on this literally since I talked to you guys last. I literally started on the dot at 1 o'clock p.m. today. I took a break from 2.44 till 3 o'clock. I made a little snack. I made some peppers with some hummus and everything but bagel seasoning on top. So good. 
and then I worked again from 3 till 6.04 and then I went to the bathroom. I have to log all of this and then I came back at 6.09 and then I just now took a break from 6.50 to 7.13 um, and showered and everything because I was just feeling so gross and I was really sweaty so like, I started getting like really hot when the sun started going down which usually happens when it starts getting warmer outside. Um, just this cute thing that my body does. Um, and then I started right back at 7.13 and I've been watching this video. I just paused it because I was like, I should probably update the vlog. Um, but yeah, I took my shower and then I also went and got my phone case. This is what I was excited to show you guys in one of my packages today. The other one was just my hair stuff, but then I was like, you guys wanted to see an updated hair care routine. So I'll just like make a video um, on that like the next time I wash my hair this week. But this is the little phone case I got. I can link it below. Um, it just says bliss happens it's tie-dye the tie-dye is like pink yellow and blue i looked like there's a little bit of purple on it but i thought like either way those colors would look cute because i have the purple one the purple phone so i thought it would like all the colors would be pretty sometimes it's hard finding a phone case with my purple um phone but i thought this was really cute and then i could have gotten the sides purple but the pink was just so vibrant and i could not pass it up and i think it's so cute and so perfect for the spring and summer season so i'm really excited about it I'm very happy. But I am going to take my mullet looking ass right now and finish this. Josh is making dinner. I have about nine, oh wait, 19 minutes. It's 10 minutes in. So I have about nine minutes left in this video. And then I will probably take a break for the rest of the night, depending on what, how much longer the next one is. And then we'll have to pick up tomorrow. I did all the ones that are due by the end of today, but there's a lot that I would really like to get done. Um, that are all due in the next couple months just because I don't want to have to stay on the 12th past the time since I have class to finish them like they're gonna have us do if they're not done so I'd rather have them done now so I can be done with them for good honestly but yes we are gonna eat dinner then probably watch more of our John Wayne Gacy docu that we're watching that's on Peacock it's so crazy you guys I cannot believe this guy is this person total monster totally crazy but it's really really intriguing it's really interesting um so if you guys are ever looking for like a really weird crime um serial killer little docu i definitely recommend it and um i think peacock is free if you have is it cbs i think you have to be subscribed to or if you just have like xfinity in, in general or something like that i could be wrong but we have xfinity so we just get it for free but yeah just wanted to recommend that so i'm gonna watch this and then i will update you guys i'll show you guys our dinner Hi, bubbles. Good morning, happy Wednesday. Today it is 10.01, Tay just got here and we are gonna go to the gym. She's been coming here every once in a while and hitting up the gym with me, which is really fun because I like working out with her and we're holding each other accountable so we can have a hot girl summer. But yeah, I just had some grapes. I'm currently snacking on them. I'm trying to drink my lemon water um, and then we're gonna change. I think I'll make us our immune, amino energy drink and then we will head to the gym. But I want to start the vlog here because she's about to walk in the door and I want her to say hi. Oh, that was a sour one. Any second now. Marvel's going crazy this morning. Um, the snow yesterday really killed my vibe. That's why I didn't vlog. I just put some little clips in there and called it a day. But yeah, today I'm up going to vlog more the snow is just like i'm if you guys have watched me for a while you know i like thrive in the snow in the fall seasons but i'm just so burnt out on them now and i think it's just like that with covid and how long it's felt like it's lasted i think i'm just kind of burnt out and i definitely would love some sunny 
warm weather and so i'm feeling really motivated and excited when it's nice out and we're supposed to have a beautiful like next like week of warm weather so really excited i did that turmeric shot so now i have turmeric burps where else i need to drink this guys also marvels back to her normal annoying self And this is why I gave up on making the couch. Mm -hmm. This is why we don't put the pillows up anymore. I've given up. That whole side of the couch is just for them. Here she comes. Where the hell is she? It does not take this long to walk up the stairs. There she is. He literally just slid like four feet. Hey, sit, stay down. How are we feeling after the gym? I feel like I wish I didn't go. <laughs> Annie, come here. How are you feeling after the gym? He says I'm ready to go my golf How do you feel after the gym, huh? My hair says a lot about it. How we're feeling right now. Maybe at one point not me, I could like Okay, Taylor just left. We ate some um, tortilla soup for lunch i am currently not feeling very well i think i overate. i think i overdid it at the gym and i think that some girl things are starting to arise so i'm going to put on like a movie or friends or something and try and take a nap i literally have no idea what else right now is going to make me feel better so i'm just going to lay here shut all the blinds and literally just try and sleep because I just am not feeling myself and I just don't think that's gonna be a productive vlog or anything like that. So we're gonna do that and then hopefully I can pick up the camera later. Um, but yeah, just wanna let you guys know. Thursday, April 1st, happy April Fool's Day. All I've done today was wake up, I cleaned the crap out of my house, reorganized my fridge, did the, did the dishes, and started some laundry, and cleaned our room pretty much. I have not done that much. Oh, and I did put the patio back together because I took it apart to um, so the snow didn't ruin it. Made some crystallite tea, this shit is so banging, you guys. Josh's mom always gets it for us. Um, Taylor's car just broke down, so we are gonna go get Tay. Well, it didn't break down. Her brakes are being a little weird. So we are gonna go get her, follow her to the car place so that they can um, fix them. So that's what we're gonna do. That's why we're kind of rushed, but sorry about last night too because it was the time of the month and it just hit me at a weird time and I the emotions, I just, it was a rough emotional day. I was very grumpy, so very sorry to my boyfriend. <laughs> Let's go get Tay Tay. Okay guys, so we picked up Tay and then dropped her car off and then me and her had a little TJ Maxx date, nothing new there. But while I was there, I got these bowls um, because Josh and I have been needing something a little bit flatter but still with like a lifted edge um, for like our poke bowls and other stuff like that. Um, and sometimes like bigger pasta dishes instead of just only having our cereal bowls. So I got two packs of those so we could have four total. Um, and then I also had to get a new one of these and this one was actually so cute because it has one for the lemons and then one for the limes, which is nice. Um, ours is starting to peel on the inside and when I did my lemon juice on Monday a piece like fell in my water and I was like okay gross let's not do that anymore and then I also the main reason I went there was because I had to get some of these guys um, I use that amino energy and I just was realizing mixing it and stuff was not working so and Josh has like three of these but he just is the worst with them so I just got my own and then I went to Ulta and I went kind of crazy. I love the skincare brand. Um, Taylor helped me find it when we kind of realized. She helped me figure out that my skin was actually dry and not oily. Um, and so I got this um, moisturizer from them. It's their double repair face moisturizer. And you can use it morning and night, which is why I got it. 
Um, so I got that. And then I always get those uh, debronzy drops from Drunk Elephant. And I just, they're so expensive to mix in with everything. And this is already two in one. So I just got this tinted moisturizer. That's this brand as well. Um, and then I think they're both reef safe too because I could not find those two ingredients on them. Then I, you guys, now I'm ride or die for my Coco and Eve stuff, but I'm running out and I desperately needed more and I did not have enough time to order it online. So I saw this there. I've actually always wanted to try Bali Body. Um, so I got their dark colored one and then I've been wanting a gradual tan. Um, I liked the idea of the loving tan one, but loving tan just makes me so orange that I just couldn't do it. But I thought Bali Body would be a nice one. So I try, I'm trying that. And then I got their face tan water too. So we'll try it all and see how it goes. And then the last thing that I got is a new Real Technique Beauty Blender. But yeah, got all this stuff. And now I think I'm going to take Svenny out, then probably shower, tan, go hang on the patio and watch a show on my laptop and probably pay my toes because they're crusty AF. But that's my haul. What about you? You like a haul? Okay, Josh is making dinner inside. He's making a home chef, which I'll show you guys, obviously, but I've been watching Bebe Hey and I'm obsessed with her, and she does a lot of these snacks, which I kind of created and did my own. Um, but I did a pepper with hummus, everything but bagel seasoning on it, and then some of these microgreens. She always does crackers and stuff like that, um, and then she throws these microgreens on it, and I thought that was such a yummy, easy way to get more greens in. So I made that. Got the babies here, helping me pay my nails and just vibe in until dinner's done. But I wanna show you guys that because I'm really excited. Okay, this is the home chef meal of the night. It's um, mushroom flatas. They look really good. Mm. How are they? Very good. Good. Mm -hmm. Guys, also look at this idiot. I cannot handle him. I'm trying to match your color. Nope. <laughs> So bad. But we're gonna eat this. I have this video that I honestly wasn't gonna post, but now I decided to because I have nothing else to post. Um, but yeah, we're gonna just enjoy the view and enjoy some dinner. Mm. Dinner? You want dinner? Oh. Okay, I don't think you guys can really see me all that well right now, but I am making us some cookies. We're really craving some sweets. We had an early dinner. This is the cookie stuff we've been using. It's just like this vegan stuff that we got at Costco. We're gonna make this, and then last night I watched John Wick, so I think tonight we're gonna watch John Wick 2. Anyways, we're gonna watch John Wick, eat our cookies, and then probably go to bed, so I'll just see you guys in the morning. Will you, will you teabag my drink for me? <laughs> you like that one? That was a good one. Babe, tell them what you did today. Tell them. Tell them that you invited me to work with you. Uh, well, since um, she knows these clients personally, I invited her to do a little task with me this morning. So <laughs> I'm actually working it's pretty girl. excited. Call me Mrs. Realtor. Call me Mrs. Josh O'Connell, Mrs. Realtor. What are we doing? What do you mean? Like, what are we going to do? We're going to Home Depot to get buddies, <laughs> hand sanitizer and masks, and then go drop them on the gas and ties. Yeah, good job. Why did you ask me that? Because I wanted to see if you knew what we were going to go do. Yeah, I'm excited. <laughs> yeah. Well, you're not excited about the task, you're just excited about being involved. I'm excited to hang out with you. I <laughs> know, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> Alright, let's go. You're gonna make this light. I'm not making anybody late. Yes, you are. Let's go! Josh and Megan is late. Okay, y'all. I cannot see you. I'm driving, so I really can't even pay attention. Um, but I'm on my way. It's like 4.30ish. I'm on my way to get dinner with my friend Megan. Um, we have not hung out one-on-one -on -one ever, so it'll be fun and interesting to see how it goes. I'm always such a weird, awkward person at first. We've known each other for like a really long time since like I think my senior year of high school, which would make her a junior, I think. Um, 
or sophomore. Oh, I can't remember. But she's such a sweetheart. Have not. I need to get to know like the adult her. We only know like the high school each other. And obviously everyone changes. I truly believe everyone who from high school is not who they are like today. Um, but yeah, I just, we're going to Postino's hopefully and getting some wine and like a little cheese board and stuff. Um, we'll see how that goes. She's there now. Um, I left so late. I was running so behind. I was trying to film my hair care routine video. It failed through. I thought she wasn't going to get off work for like another hour. And then all of a sudden she got off like super early and I was like, Mm, I still have to finish my makeup and do my hair, so yeah, we're just, we're a little flabbergasted right now, we're a little, we're just a little behind, but she said the wait, the line is like out the door there, um, so that's not fun, but she said there's a lot in that area, so we might have to go somewhere else, who knows, I'm just wearing like my goldie jeans, my platform converse, this tank top from Zara, and then this jacket, jacket, whatever the hell they're called these days, up from princess polly but yeah i'm going to keep driving keep jamming out to queen and then i will update you guys when i finally meet up with nick I bet you don't think a lot of vlogs start out like this, but they do. <laughs> I look old and Josh is burnt. I went to the pool, got some sun. <laughs> oh. We got a lot of sun. We had some shandies. We're about to make some more shandies, but we're gonna try something. Mm. So I wanted to vlog it. So I, I'm using my little, my little Starbucks cup from Bunch Cups. I filled the ice up to the second line. So we're gonna put a whole, what is this linen, what linen kurgles? Linen klugen. Linen kurgles. Linen klugen. Linen, linen. It's K-U, not, there's no linen, L. Where are you getting the L? Linen kurgen. Linen kurgen. Nope. I think it's linen kugel. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's right. Linen kugel. Okay, and then it's a summer shandy. Mm -hmm. They're so good in the summer, they do have a lot of wheat in it, so if you're gluten intolerant. Just make sure you don't care about the bloating because I bloat so fast. But I, even Josh was bloating from it in the can, but when we poured it into this, immediately it like helped a lot more. So <laughs> whatever I was saying about this, being outside of it makes the carbonation, I think, digest a little bit easier. But we're going to put a whole one of these in here. It's really hard because it keeps foaming so bad, like no matter how I pour it. Look at that. And then we'll pour the rest in with the Crystal Light Raspberry Green Tea Tea. Guys, this stuff green tea tea. is bussin' bussin' bussin'. <laughs> it slaps titties. I'm not kidding you. It's so good. Josh and I are obsessed with it. So, but we do like the peach one more. I look like I'm like George Clooney up in here, but what can you do? Anyways, I'm dry shampooing because I got oil in my hair. And I don't want to wash it tonight because I washed it last night. I look like a lobster. Well, I'm your sugar mommy and you're my lobster. Okay. Oh, you're my lobster. Oh, but I'm right. oh. <laughs> Love you. Love you. <laughs> Very cute. That was so cute. Also, we are doing Home Chef tonight because I don't know if I announced it in last week's vlog. Maybe I did. But we are going back to Home Chef, at least for a little bit. We're getting really bored with recipes and cooking. So we are doing Home Chef also because I'm starting a job and we think just like with like the new schedule that's about to be coming up. <laughs> so yeah. We gotta pick it up and pour it in there for the, oh, the camera. Okay, all right. Okay, okay, okay. Go away, fix it. That's probably good. It'll be like, oh, look at that mix. Did oh you guys see gosh. that? Let's replay that in slow mo. Slow mo. Slow mo real. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna show up a grand and be like, what? Woo! Who's ready to bowl? <laughs> Woo! You can be first sips. Okay. Should I rank it like one out of ten? Yeah. Okay. And also rank it if you want to put more tea in there or something. Okay. I'm so excited. Is it bus and bus and bus? It is pretty good. <laughs> it's so good. Say it, says bus and bus and bus and bus and bus. <laughs> 
I think it's just the right amount of tea. It's good. Yeah. It is sweet though. I'm glad it's on ice. Yeah. Very I sweet. rank it an 8.7 out of 10. I rate it. Just because I'm bad at drinking beer and I really like iced tea, I'll probably rate it like a 9 out of 10. Yeah, I knew yours was going to be higher than mine. Um, but doing the walnut crusted chicken with basil, pesto sauce, and green beans. The green beans look like they're wrapped in onions, which I'm not a fan of, but I can eat around that. We also usually do the like gluten and dairy free options, but for the most part, as like with, we I think we do the gluten free one, but we get dairy. Yeah. Um, and the dairy's usually very easy to substitute. Um, like the last meal we had, like I chose to keep their dairy because I thought it sounded better, but we could have easily put all of that cheese on Josh's, and then I could have used my own like follow your heart vegan cheese. But anyways, we're gonna cook dinner. <laughs> We're gonna cook dinner and then we are going to eat dinner. <laughs> we're gonna cook dinner, we're gonna eat dinner, and then we're gonna shower and get ready. And then we're going bowling tonight with some of our friends. Josh's best friend, like one of his best friends slash roommates from college. Technically he's one of my roommates too, since I did live with you guys for yeah. like two years. Constitution, 1505 Constitution, <laughs> shout out. <laughs> um and they, him and his girlfriend finally moved to Colorado and we're so excited. Um, and then their other roommate, Grant, that's actually been Josh's best friend since high school, yep. um, also lives literally down the block from us. So we're all gonna go bowling. We're really excited. We're also gonna go see their new apartment, have some drinks and some snacks and stuff. And we're bringing you guys along. So George and Grant and I have a bet going. Whoever loses has to pay for drinks at our next golf outing, so. Well, good thing I'll be rolling the dice. Rolling the dice. Guys, we decided to do our own little thing to the green beans, and I was like, I'm gonna put salt and pepper on it. So I look in our cabinet. This is our spice cabinet, okay? I could not find the salt and pepper for the life of me. Josh here says, oh, I just had it out. It was around here somewhere. And after a while of going through this, I was like, okay, it's not in here. I looked through all of our cabinets, because I was like, he had to put it somewhere. I opened the fridge, look where he put <laughs> this on the so right. Oh my god, I can't. Wow, at least they're chilled. Okay, here is the final product. We have not done a taste test yet. I didn't have time to do my hair, but I'm wearing this tank top from Princess Polly, this plaid shirt from Princess Polly, my Goldie jeans, and my platform Converse. Babe, what are you wearing? I'm wearing jeans and a shirt. <laughs> I didn't have time to do my hair the way I wanted to, so I just threw it in a clip per usual. But yeah, we're gonna go upstairs. And party, like the good old days. Back to 1505 Constitution. Scrapes me with your bracelet. Babe, I'm so sorry. That's okay. Babe, I'm, yeah, I'm so sorry. Guys, we're playing laser tag. Laser tag. Laser tag. We're, I'm a few, what are my drinks? Moscow Mio's beef. Yeah, Moscow. Josh just took a shot of tequila and I can smell it. It's honestly kind of grossing me out. We're going to play laser tag. Basically. 